we are at Fiola Miami for a very special event with our partners BYN Mellon Bank and Baptist Hospital for a very special wine tasting with Ferragamo. That's Salvatore Ferragamo. <laughs> Welcome back this week. This is Season 8, Episode 6. I'm Renzo Rosato. And I'm Gaston Rosato. And today we're going to be looking at a great event we recently had and we want to share with you all. Before we do, make sure you hit that subscribe button for us. And after this video, check out the channel where we have hundreds of videos looking at some badass cars, some really great reviews, and some insight on the business. That's right, Renzo. You know, for us here, this event in particular, was, you know, it hit close to home, right? Because like you said, a lot of different factors design, legacy, passion. And that's kind of what we do here at the barn, right? Absolutely. And and we do what we do because our dad was in the business before and we've learned the craft and we continue what we love, right? And this is very true to our guest of honor, right? Mr. Salvatore Ferragamo. And we're going to talk about that in just a little bit. But, you know, here at the barn I think the market kind of knows us for always doing things a little bit differently. Right. In fact, you know, Bloomberg just did a whole article on us about exactly that, how we're not exactly a dealership, although we are a dealership, right? So we're always looking for ways to differentiate ourselves from the rest, always taking it up a notch and just getting creative, right? That's yeah. what it's all about, getting creative. And at the same time, give our clients an experience that right. goes beyond just, hey, I sold you this car, see you later, call me when you want to sell it. So little events like this, like the one that we just did, allows us to keep our clients close, be introduced to new clients, of course, and, and tell them, hey, we really appreciate you. We want to continue doing things with you, and this is just a gift from us to you, right? So first and foremost, a very huge and big thank you to our partners, Baptist Health Foundation, and BYN Mellon Bank, because without that, it would just yeah. wasn't possible. Right. Uh, you know, and being able to secure Salvatore Ferragamo was, I mean, the icing on the cake. Absolutely. And really what gave the event the edge of exclusivity. You know, we did it in a beautiful setting over in Fiola, Miami, with, you know, we had all the wine cabinets, very long tables, very personal event too, about 40 people or so. Yeah. And we got to do wine tasting because what people don't know is they also do wine. Exactly. So Salvatore Ferragamo is also known for the design clothing, but this is Salvatore Ferragamo's grandson. And he is a twin brother. The brother, his brother is managing the design of Ferragamo. He's in charge of their winery, their vineyard. It's called Il Boro. This is only passion and they're super passionate about it, right? So Salvatore's wife was there as well. I was lucky enough to sit on the on that end of the table. Yeah. And uh, and they're just extremely passionate people and they love what they're doing. And the biggest conversation we had on our end of the table was keeping that family business alive through generations and what it takes, um, which was, I, I love to hear it because that's what we're working on here on building our, our, our legacy, our, our foundation so that the barn in Miami can continue on from generations. And I love to hear things that he said, right? So he said, listen, you're born into this family, you have a lot of options, but basically there's two. You can become a shareholder where you have nothing to do with the family business or you become part of the operation, but you're not allowed just to be part of the operation. First, you gotta get a degree, then you have to get a master's, and then you need at least, I think it's a two or three years of experience in the field that you wanna follow for the family business outside of the family business. Right. And once you do that, you start at the, at the bottom levels of operation and then you work yourself up through the corporation until hopefully one day manages. Exactly. So he, his father had bought this vineyard. He said, I, I love, I, he just fell in love with wines and he jumped on a plane, he went to Argentina, the wine country there and learned everything he could about wines to prove to his father that he can in fact be the head of this operation and today he is so again close to home we loved it i think our clients loved it the food was amazing on top of all of that and then most of all was we, we all got to bring our clients in and, and bring them together got to meet some new people um, and made some really good connections the fact is if you're into wine you're into these kind of things yeah. italy design passion family legacy 
and of course cars. Exactly. Thank so we tied all this together in that one event. Yes. It was fantastic. If you have some awesome ideas that you want to introduce to us or you want to team up with us perhaps to do something unique and create, like we said, an experience, please, by all means, reach put out. it in the comments, reach out. In the meantime, guys, we want to thank you again for all your support and love. Hit that subscribe button. Find us on social. And in the, we'll be back next week. That's right. I'm Renzo Rosato. And I'm Gaston Rosato. Peace out.